here. It is the greatest invention ever. The problem is at the moment you get it in your mouth, it wants to come out of you. And that's no good. That's why I'm here with master hacker, David Switalski. He's gonna show us how a true beer lover gets relief with a keg urinal. Tell me about yourself. What makes you qualified to hack a keg into a urinal? Well, avid beer drinker. Okay. Avid plumber. Yeah. Avid urinator. You checked all my boxes, that's good. But for someone at home, they can actually do this. this is, they could take a keg, they can cut it, and you're telling me they can turn this into a fully functional urinal. Absolutely. Where do you actually use a beer keg urinal? Uh, any man cave, back at a garage. I guess like maybe you got a pool and you want people dipping, getting wet, and running inside. Exactly. Throw one outside. Perfect. And this is probably a lot cheaper than buying an actual urinal. Absolutely. All right, let's hack a keg urinal. Got it? All right, you've got the full face shield. Yes, and I've got this, which tells me I should probably take a giant step over here. Oh, yeah. All right, first, you're gonna wanna cut a hole in the keg. That's delightful! Approximately two hours later, David, you're done with this cut? Yep. And what about this guy here? Once you take a retaining ring out here, the dip tube comes out in one piece. Got it, so that's removed. All right, so now you've bolted the urinal to the wall. Yes. So then how do we actually clean this bad boy out? Well, you're gonna use recovered rainwater to flush this urinal. Awesome, so you got a bucket, you drilled a hole in it to connect two more pipes to put it into here. Yes. So your rainwater is gonna collect up here, it's gonna yes. come down the pipe. This will normally be... Closed. Yeah, closed. That'll Boom. stop the flow. You can turn it on and off, and it's gonna flush the urinal. All right. So David, is this up to like a plumbing code? It's up to keg urinal code. Good enough for me? This isn't, what are you doing here? I'm creating the flushing device. Oh, because if we didn't have that, it would just go straight down. It would go straight down. Here you're making like a PVC waterfall shower head of sorts. Right? Exactly. Okay. Here we go. <laughs> okay, so you're getting the final piece on there. Now yep. that could drain to anywhere. You can pipe that. Out behind the fence, to your neighbor's yard, wherever you like to do it. Urine is sterile. You're, you can pipe it to a garden. So you could use it to actually water your plants. Absolutely. So now we just need our rainwater to flush the toilet. I love that it's a hack within a hack, that we can repurpose it. It's very green, or yellow, or however you want to look at it. It's great. Let it fly. It's a miracle! The shower function totally works. It got the water all over. Most importantly, the hack within the hack, we're watering our plants. How do you beat that? You don't. We're recycling this rainwater. This is a great hack, David. Thank you. No, thank you, man. I appreciate it. You want to get a beer? Did you wash your hands? What? Huh?